Hey, 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 loves, welcome back to my YouTube channel. Okay, if this is your first time seeing this face uh, or coming to this channel, please, uh, thank you so much for coming by. But please subscribe please subscribe i know please subscribe okay oh, okay let me wait for you for a moment have you subscribed thank you <laughs> thank you so much for subscribing and if you are a returning subscriber thank you <laughs> thank you loves thank you so much for coming back to my channel Thank you so much for staying uh for pushing me to where i am right now mm -hmm. yes thank you Mwah. right today i'm going to be reviewing a nigerian uh romantic drama okay uh, it is titled the one for sarah right some people would say uh nigerian movies i don't like ninja no nope. i do like i love Nigerian movies. Why do I love Nigerian movies? Because uh, it's more relatable, right? Um, it kind it kinds of resonate to what is happening with us in Nigeria, right? We, we we it's it's something that is happening here. So yeah, it's relatable. That's pretty much it, right? And I don't think I would ever stop watching Nigerian movies. Maybe because they are short, right? Shorter than all these Indian movies, two hours. Hey, God. Too long. So, The One for Sarah is a Nigerian romantic drama. Uh, it also has a little bit of violence in it, right? The cast is Bimbo Ademoye, um, Beverly Naya, um, Uzo, um, and then, yes, Daniel Etim. A film, right? Mm -hmm. uh, yes. So these are the major characters in the movies, in the movie, right? There are other people, right? But yeah, let's get into it. So um, Beverly Naya is a major character. She is a fashion designer, and then uh, she, her friend is her best friend is Bimbo Ademoye, right? And then she, her ex is daniel etim right they had dated and broken up right uh, at the beginning of the movie but apparently he was he was aha uh -huh, okay good so he was beating her and that was why she left and then you know this kind of people that do not get over people i don't know how but he wasn't over her right he was looking for her sending her text messages and the rest so she was always 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 careful uh -huh. and shaggy 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 was the gatekeeper right so whenever she comes back through the back gate shaggy would have locked the gate they locked the gate by 10 o'clock and then ah uh, my goodness shaggy was a nuisance in that movie anyway there was one day he locked the gate and then she was trying to fly the fence so her dress got caught on the fence and then um, uh, there was this guy that came and he was like mm, he was trying to video her because he's a photographer right um and then she got really pissed and then anyway he helped her come down from the fence and then he just wanted to be friends with her right and then one day he went to her where she was selling you know i told you she's a fashion designer where she sell she makes clothes like okay it's a showroom right where she was selling those clothes that she makes right he went there with her sister and then his sister and then he was like oh, okay like yeah i know you and all that so anyway i'm trying to establish that because yeah he's going to help her later 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 in the movie right so aha uh -huh. uzo is Uzo met her the day her gown tore, right, just on the road, and gave her his suit, and then she had to return it the next day. She washed it, returned it, and, you know, they just started to be friends from there. Like, he was not like, can they go out? So they went out, you know, they went out, had fun, and then she went to the bathroom. Coming back, 
she saw that he was with another girl and guess who this girl is this girl is the sister to that guy that was vid making a video of her when she was coming down from that fence right on that scene right that's the sister and guess what that guy is Uzo's friend Uzo's, Uzo's closest friend right so his sister of course obviously she was drunk that day he had to hold her but uh, Beverly Naya was very angry and she left right at that point guys they were already loving each other liking each other you know all those ceremony like you know although she was trying to avoid guys because of what the trauma she's you know she's traumatized she was traumatized from her previous relationship and all that and then this guy this her ex daniel etim kept sending her messages the uzo is a businessman and daniel was his associate right and that was bad enough because all of them were connected <laughs> So anyway, he let he sent her a letter that he sent her a message that he went to her previous place where she was living before and she had moved that he's going to find her and show her Shege. Anyway, he found her and he beat the hell out of her in a new apartment. Bimbo came as a friend, you know, you know that you know all those things passed, you know, and she felt like it was Uzo that gave Daniel her address because she saw Uzo and, and Daniel together one time, right? So this other guy that saw her on the fence, right? I remember I told you he's a photographer. So he came to her shop and wanted to collaborate with her. And then, aha, uh -huh, she was now collaborating with him, right? She collaborated with him. She got convinced. Guys, I almost forgot that Aduni Ade was was in this is in this movie too. So um yes, so when Ad Aduni Ade is Aduni is um Beverly's customer, right? Regular customer, she's married to a billionaire, right? So she knows the photographer that is a very big photographer in in town right so she had to convince beverly to work with him so she agreed and that was the best thing that happened to her right she she got um she got her she, she got to showcase her her fashion line right and then um hmm one day she came back they were they were ju they just finished the fashion show and she got back home and thank goodness this guy was there to help her carry her things inside and then bam daniel attacked attacked the guy though and then attacked beverly right and also did not even know that this was the guy that traumatized this girl even though i'm very sure he will not do business with him right but anyway last 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 there was a day the last day that this thing the movie ended right was the day that Uzo showed him Shege. <laughs> you know, when a man loves a woman, when a man loves a woman. Mm -hmm. Anyway, he showed, he showed, Uzo showed Daniel Shege, dealt with him, dealt with him. Of course, I'm very sure he didn't, he did not even want to do business with him anymore. Anyway, Sarah finally, Sarah, who is Beverly Naya, finally found love with Uzo, right? It's a happy ever after situation. And then the next thing I saw was Buchi Michael, who was the photographer, who is the photographer that was snapping Beverly Naya the other time, like at the beginning of the movie. And Bimbo and Demoye, they were married and Bimbo was pregnant. They were doing a photo shoot mm, one year later right um uh, <laughs> anyway so um beverly and i got married to uzo and bimbo got married to the love of her life right in the movie it was a happy ending i loved it uh the men they're protective right it's 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 a good one anyway thank you so much uh guys for watching this video this uh review 
okay the next video i'm going to do movie recommendation okay so please um expect that coming for turkish movies to watch in 2023 okay i love turkish movies too so wait for that thank you so much for watching until this time until next time see you soon bye bye